Awesome. Uh, next up, Netflix. <coughs> Thanks to Netflix for sponsoring Dignation. Netflix offers over 90,000 titles, including lots of Blu-ray titles, with free shipping both ways from your home. Um, I have got some g great new, uh, I want to talk about a couple movies that I've just recently seen that uh, are on Netflix that I highly recommend. Do it, do it. One in particular that I'm sure you've probably never heard of. <clears throat> it's a documentary on the font Helvetica. And it is, uh, it's just called Helvetica. And check it out, it is amazing. For graphic designers out there. Are you there, kidding me? I'm not this kidding This is awesome. You. It's freaking awesome. It's a documentary about all about design and the way that fonts are made and what kind of message they convey. And it's just like, it's an amazing, brilliant, like well, I mean these guys traveled all over the place to interview all these different, went to these font foundries and talked to these guys that have been making fonts for years. And it really is a good, good movie. Yeah. So if you're into design <clears throat> and into web stuff, uh, Helvetica, it's available right now. Um, well also you should mention. Shit. I know, it's a play now. It's a play now, so you can play instantly. A I, lot I got of their into beta. A lot of their documentaries. You got into the beta for the Xbox 360 new experience? Or something else? The beta for the uh, the Mac. It comes out next week, the 360 new oh, experience. Oh, oh, right. Um, uh, yeah, no, no, no. I was going to say, because I forgot that it, could, it wasn't didn't do that on the Mac for the longest time. But uh, I was going to say, a lot of the documentaries, and they have some great documentaries. Mm -hmm. Like, I just watched... Um, that soup, uh, uh, Confessions of a Superhero. Oh, was that good? Oh, dude, you guys saw see that. that I was gonna, is it really good? So, oh, it's so good. Okay. But a lot of their documentaries are all watched now. Okay, and yeah. then also, um, make sure to check out uh, Gattaca. I just saw Gattaca for the first time. Oh, really? Yeah. On Blu ray? Yeah, on Blu ray. That's yeah, pretty cool. It's pretty badass. If you yeah. haven't seen Gattaca, definitely check that out. Yeah, as well. I liked it. So, anyway, those are my picks for the week. Uh, Netflix plans start at $4.99, and as a new member, you can get two weeks free. So, you can watch all these movies for free for two weeks and cancel it yeah. if you don't like it. Uh, check out www.netflix.com slash dignation. Make sure to use the W, W, They w, are w, important. W, w, w. Just three. Three. Four. Three. Three. GoDaddy.com starting at less than $5 a month. Web hosting from GoDaddy.com includes 99% uptime, 24-7 support, free access to GoDaddy hosting connection, the place to quickly install over 50 free applications like WordPress, Joomla, Drupal, OS Commerce. Have you used any of this? I've used Joomla and Drupal. I have pretty used good. Actually, WordPress too. I've used WordPress. Project Lore is based on WordPress. We're going to move over to Drupal, I think, at some <clears> point. <throat> nice. Uh, and more. Plus, enter the code DIG2. That's D I G G 2. When you check out, save an additional $5 off any order of $30 or more. Some restrictions apply. Seaside for details. Get your piece of the internet. Good. Did it. Dot cam. Awesome. Awesome. <laughs> Last story of the day. This one is a good one. You're on Instagram for this. Uh, I'm excited. It was 689 digs submitted by oh, Dan Heward. That's so funny. I didn't even, I didn't even know he submitted that. Um, that's awesome. That's weird. It's weird when a friend of yours submits something and you're Oh, my like, God, dude. And listen to me see? complaining about that. There's right, our Dignation banner on dig. So stupid. Okay. Um, <clears throat> 23 and Me, Time Magazine's Invention of the Year for 2008. Look how stu the stupid look on my face. I'm like, e you're saying <laughs> something smart. Um, <laughs> we, we need to come up with better We're gonna banners. We're going to do right. some fun stuff. Um, we are at the, and this is a quote from the description, we are at the beginning of a personal, uh, oh gosh, Gen I can say genome, uh, genome revolution that will transform not only the way we take ourselves, but also uh, what we mean by personal information. So I recently <laughs> yeah, what is this? got one of these kits in the mail. What they're talking about is a service called 23andMe. And I got one of the kits in the mail, and I created an account, and here's what happens. Um, they send you a package, and it's a little box. It looks like a freaking video game, right? Cool, I like that. And you unwrap it, and inside of it is a little test tube. And you take the test tube out, and you spit into it, and you fill it up with spit about that far, right? Okay. And then you, you crack this little thing over the top, and it puts a solution in there. And then it comes with a little pouch that's like a FedEx pouch. Oh. And you drop it in the FedEx pouch, and you mail it off and, and send it in the mail, right? And then they take, it takes a couple weeks to process your results. Yeah. And they go through and they read your little genome and they, they look at all the different little traits that you might potentially have. Dude, and then they create, a, they create a report for you. <clears throat> and it shows you like whether or not you have certain markers for things like prostate cancer, uh, like Crohn's Dude. disease, type 1 diabetes, all these different things, right? <clears throat> oh, I love it. They show you um, about your family uh, history, like your, oops, let me type out my password again. Um, they show you things like, um, it shows you like where you came from, uh, what, what parts of like, uh, of, of, 
of, of the world you're from, like your ancestors, kind wow. of predictions for your body weight mass index, like your endurance, you, if you're female, your fertility, uh, whether you can taste things that are bitter, like they can tell it all. What? Yeah, dude, it's insane. All from your spit? All, all from your spit. And oh, I gotta try this. It's like Gattaca. I thought it was sperm. It is like Gattaca. <laughs> it, it, what's that? Is it sperm? No, it's not sperm, it's spit. But um, well, I'll put sperm in there just in case. <laughs> Thank you, hippie. Do not Thank do, you, hippie. Do not do that. That'd be awesome. Um, like. So, isn't this awesome? Like, look at the bitter tasting. It shows you like which markers you have, and it breaks it all down. It's got pretty amazing graphics. <clears throat> like wow. the, the website. Go take the demo at the website, 23andMe.com. It's pretty freaking awesome. I'm gonna talk to them and see if we can get you a kit because you got to try this. Dude, I'd love to. You can, we should do it on air and then talk about how quickly we're gonna die. It, it, no, but the cool thing is, you can you can uh, friends you can friend other people and share your information with them. Oh, that's like cool. Like certain things, and it'll show you like how you compare to each other and like how closely related you are to that person. Oh, that's cool. So let's compare each other. Yeah, and, and see and, if we're related. Um, you know who else has done this? Uh, Jay Allison did this, um, and yeah. then. Uh, Sergey from Google is friends with Jay Adelson, so they're comparing their information nice. and all kinds of stuff. Love so it, dude. It's, it's pretty insane, man. <clears throat> it's, um, how, now how long has this been out, and who does it? Like, so what? the problem, though, this has been out for a long time, um, but the problem was that this was always very expensive to do. Yeah. Up until like a month ago, it was $1,000 to get the test run. Uh, yeah, but, it's now, a much. but now it's, um, it's $399. Which is not bad. It's it's finally that price point to where like you're like you know if you really if you think that you might have like you had parents that had a certain something that you're a little concerned yeah. about or you just want to know more about you well, know. yeah like my great my grandfather died of colon cancer it's, and so like my dad gets tested gene, and then when right. I turn forty I gotta start getting tested yearly for it and stuff like that but if I knew I didn't even have the gene it would be like all right good still get tested because as a right. guy you gotta get tested for all that stuff when you get hit to a certain age but at least it would give you that peace of mind yeah yeah knowing like oh, all right or go and get tested more frequently if you do have it you yeah know what I mean? exactly. stuff like that so anyway Dude, epic. Th so they're always yeah, constantly out, updating the research too so they're adding new stuff in all the time yeah. as it becomes known so oh, it's, it's pretty cool stuff epic yeah so it's called 23 and me and w and it it was actually a Time Magazine Invention of the yeah, Year. Yeah, so the story was about the fact that it won Time Magazine's Invention of the Year for for this year. Wow, so, um, it's pretty sweet. Dude, that's epic. The or yeah, the yeah, number, number so, so it's two three a n d m e dot com. Yeah. Also, it's probably right here ish. <laughs> like right down here, here somewhere. somewhere. Probably not here. -ish. <laughs> Maybe right over here. Uh, All right. It depends upon what kind of graphic over package we use. It's a technical term for productions. All right, uh, let's hit some emails, shall we? So, I am just going to pull something out of my poop since we didn't actually look through the emails before the show. Oh, shit, I didn't yes. either. Yes. So I'm just going to grab this one, which is, and this is, usually we like read a couple. Totally cool. So this is Thailand Picks from Andrew. Uh, hi, Kevin and Alex. My f fiance, congratulations, and soon to be a wife on November 15th. Congratulations, you might already be married. Robin and I have recently returned to Nova Scotia, Canada. Well, uh, from a year of teaching English over in South Korea. Korea is epic. Love their food, by the oh, way. Oh, I want to go. Oh, come uh, <laughs> Did you use the. I said some Korean stuff. You said thanks in Korean. That's what I did. Uh, it was probably one of the best things I've ever done in my life. While I was there, I decided to introduce Robin to Dignation. Congratulate, dude, this story just keeps getting better. I hope nobody dies. I'm gonna keep reading here, <laughs> blindly. <laughs> uh, I'd been watching for about a year already, but never thought she would like it. Turns out uh, she thought it was a great show, so I decided to order her a Dignation shirt. Unfortunately, uh, the first order got lost in the mail after two months of waiting to make sure it wasn't just delayed. A replacement shirt was sent out, good on them, uh, but it turned out to be the wrong kind of shirt. Okay, it was a Dig shirt instead of a Dignation shirt. Uh, there was no time left to make the change because by this time we were getting ready to leave for Korea. However, we dis first decided to take the trip three weeks to Thailand. So now they're in Thailand. This is amazing. I wish I was this couple. Uh, Are you just reading a random email? Yes. This was such a great experience. But I must say I've enjoyed it. We we'll send you a shirt. Yeah, we're going to send no, you guys no, no, a I shirt. Just, he's got like four paragraphs. He's well, like, I don't know, and I'm then just I took to... her for a walk down the beach. She enjoyed it. We had great. nice food. It was. Like, it was good. Yeah. <laughs> it was a great experience. I enjoyed Korea much. Uh, blah, blah, blah. On a side note, uh, if you're ever doing another live dignation in Asia, I would recommend uh, Busan in South... I said it like it was French. Uh, Busan in South Korea. Anyway, even though Korea was my favorite place, I thought you guys might like a picture of my fiance in Thailand wearing her dig shirt uh, uh, yes. and one of her in the front of a long tail boat on the way back to the beach. So here she is frolicking in the Tahitian sun. Is it Tahiti? No, it's Tahiti. 
Look at that, oh, it's so awesome. sweet. Oh my God, oh, underwater camera. Oh, those are cool. Seriously, I gotta go on. We gotta, I gotta, we gotta go somewhere tropical. Oh, we gotta go somewhere nice. tropical. All right. Uh, so, congratulations, Andrew. I got a, uh, another email. Cool. Uh, this one from Daniel. Uh, subject is cocoa nibs. Hey guys, I was at Whole Foods <laughs> the other day and came across oh. the raw cocoa nibs that you guys talked about many episodes yeah. back. Yeah. You both cacao. Cacao nibs. <laughs> cacao. Oh, how did I just get logged out? Cacao. Mother freaker. <laughs> I'm trying not to cuss, prayer. Sign in. Just say um, sign in. Dignation what? fans. Don't say the password out loud. Okay, first of all, I've put in like five passwords since we've been here, um, and that top cam has to be shut off because I put in. Oh, I love it. I seriously have put in like dig passwords, ah. all kinds of shit since we've been here. Blur oh, no, 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 like oh. someone either, either we need to get rid of the camera or somebody needs to go through it with a fine tooth comb. Can it read my my screen text too? No, no, sure. we'll, we'll, we'll have to look. We'll have That's to check afterwards because I also epic. I have I have um, growl notifications. 